Now let me introduce our friends to you. The one at your left is the youngest and the cutest female South American woman that we have here. And her name is none other than Isabel. And with her is her trainer, Jerry. American sea lion that we have here and that makes him the handsome one. And his name is none other than Pinson. And with him is his friend Eric. Okay, close now, let's move on. So do you have any idea why they are called fin or feathered footed marine mammals? Any idea, kids? Do they have feathers? No, well actually it's because of their front flippers, which are shaped like a bird's wing. The term pinniped may also be translated as wing-footed, since the flipper do look somewhat like wings. In fact, sea lion appear to be flying underwater as they swim from place to place, right buddy? Yes. And they are also mistaken as seals. One of the differences between seals and sea lion is the fact that they have bigger front flippers. And they can also turn their back flippers, something seals cannot do. As a result, they can walk upright while on land. Well, there it is. They can surely walk on land and that's a fine demonstration. So how about another round of applause for a sea lion brand? And you know what, folks? They have this long and flexible neck. How flexible? Well, check this out. Whoa, so flexible. And that's not easy. So how about another round of applause for Big Sam and Isabel? I am my own. Their body is covered with a thin coat of short, coarse hair. Their whiskers tell the sea lion's sense of touch. It contains nerve fibers with